With so many new AI tools out there and all of them promise you to generate new leads, to optimize those leads, to get your marketing forward, to save you manual time, which one are the actual good ones to choose from? This video will give you the answers. I'm gonna share with you the whole list of all the AI and conversational AI tools that I believe really go ahead in 2024 and help you as a business to really scale, to kind of get the resources that you actually need without just employing new people, but more kind of leveraging what you already have so that you can get to new heights and you can scale ahead of your competitors. All of the tools you're going to see originated either from previous projects that I've run or that my community kind of looked into and that I looked into, we kind of created videos about and some more little insights that you definitely want to check out while watching. So let's get started. As you can see on my screen, I made a super, super sweet presentation for you in a couple of minutes using Canva. Obviously, if you don't know Canva, definitely check it out. It's worth it. It helps me a lot to just speed up my processes. But to jump into the very first tool, it's probably something that surprises you a little bit, which is called WhatsApp Flows. So WhatsApp Flows is basically a new kind of service that WhatsApp business offers, where you can kind of create workflows for your actual WhatsApp business account. So so instead of just writing a normal user message journey or something like that, or just some, some quick replies, you can actually kind of define in a certain way steps that a user has to run through to do certain things. And this is amazing and super, super powerful. And I would say fairly new, it just came out a couple of months ago. So definitely check it out. It really, really helps you to speed up the process to just convert more people with WhatsApp. And as I know now as well, thanks to you guys, you really using a lot of WhatsApp out there, even for the business side, if it comes to real estate or, or other kind of industry. So I thought to add that as one in as well, cause I played around with it a couple of times. We had maybe like two or three implementations so far. I need to check into that. But those implementations have been already super powerful and to kind of use that whole setup, it's just amazing how it works, right? And the best thing of all is we can also kind of feed that information into AI and create those workflows using AI in a certain way to just, again, speed up the process. So that is definitely something you wanna look into. And as I mentioned here, it also has for, for obviously driving customer acquisition, it's extremely scalable and it is perfect for medium-sized businesses and enterprises. Like I mentioned before, for smaller companies that can manually answer to requests, for you it probably doesn't make sense to try to set it up right now, because it still involves a bit of manual work and a little bit of more technical knowledge, just to get that whole thing set up with your JSON constructs whatsoever. So if you want to learn more about JSON and those things, you can check out some other videos on my channel, I made a lot about that. That probably gives you a head start so that you can try to implement it if you really want to. But if you're in the very beginning, it's probably easier to just answer those requests manually for now, and you can kind of implement those automations a bit later, but definitely something to check out for anyone that is serious about business. The second tool we are going to look in is something that you have seen thousands of times on my channel. It's called VoiceFlow. It is basically a visual no-code slash low-code platform that allows you to create chatbots that can be implemented into different services like, like Slack, for example, on your website. You can share it with other people. It's, it's just amazing. And all of that is done in a visual way so that you basically don't need to code anything. You can connect it to other no-code slash low-code services like make.com, Zapier, Public Connect, Microsoft Power Automate, integrately there are tons of them out there and it can be integrated with all of them through webhooks and apis so it is a super super powerful tool with which you can already create amazing chatbots in a way to kind of take manual work off your hands. And like I mentioned here as well, it's great for small and medium sized companies. I know they also do some large size companies or enterprise stuff, but I think especially if you try to get into that business, it's a bit more complex for them. And I think there are other tools that actually help you more to get kind of into that, especially with things like human takeovers, which is a very massive point as well as like massive resource databases, which I believe can be better in a certain way. But for anyone that just wants to get started quick and doesn't need to have a, a custom implementation in a certain way, definitely check out VoiceFlow. I also provide tons of tutorials tutorials and templates that you can literally just implement directly into your business. You can download them from our resource hub, everything for free, by the way, and just implement them wherever you need them. So that already brings us to the third tool, which is Intercom. And I know Intercom has been around for a very long time, but I have always been a big fan of them. And especially now, since I just see how they actually implement AI into their business, it became incredibly easy to do. It became super powerful. And from what I see, they really working hard on bringing out new and solid features to kind of just help again to optimize the process for your clients, etc. So in case you have something like a SaaS tool that has a knowledge base behind it, it is really worth to check it out. I know it's not really cheap, so that's why I wrote as well here for medium-sized companies to enterprises. It makes sense as well for smaller companies, but again, it's more a thing of, a of your budget, so you can definitely check it out. I think it's a great tool. It's worth it if you really implement some kind of chatbots and you want to do both like the client side or the, the customer side or guest side, sided interactions 
chatbots basically talk with unknown guests, but also where you already have like an online community inside your SaaS and you want to provide information through that. It's just incredibly powerful and I'm a very, very big fan of it. So this is another amazing tool to check out. And all of those three tools I showed you so far are, I think, really going to pop off even more in 2024. As I already know, they have a robust base, they work, they have an amazing team behind, they bring out tons of value. And all of that comes to my next thing, which I think is one of my favorite things so far out there. And this is called Rasa. And a lot of you probably aren't the ones who know it, they know it amazing, but I think the majority of people watching my channel probably don't know it yet. And it is just a really, really powerful open source base of a conversational AI tool or service. So it is basically a kind of platform where you can also build chatbots on. Like I mentioned in my last video, where I kind of went over the my kind of workflows I want to use to scale my clients in 2024 using AI and automation. And it's just such an amazing tool because it allows you to create chatbots in a way that they are secure. They are very hard to be manipulated in a certain way while still being super flexible and they are still leveraging AI to its fullest potential so you can really build amazing workflows and amazing apps and integrations with them. So the best thing about it is it's open source so everyone can work on it which I believe is just amazing because you know how it is that a lot of open source projects just pass by the ones that are from certain companies that don't make their stuff open source just because they have communities of thousands and thousands of people that can work on one product instead of just having a specific product team to roll out things. So it's just incredibly powerful and I'm a very very big fan of it and for the fact that it's open source they still have extras on top of their platform where enterprises can basically build chatbots in a more visual way which still I don't believe it's really necessary if you know what you're doing but this is an amazing tool and I'm pretty sure Rasa will come even more in 2024 especially probably even more for for like medium to large scale enterprises with other platforms that go outside of Rasa because even though Rasa is open source and it's free to use so you can kind of set it up on your very own server and use it there as a as a conversational AI server where you basically connect APIs to it and it sends stuff back just like you do it with voice flow in a certain way just not visually but only through APIs but it's just going to be incredibly powerful because it allows you to really build complex chatbots that follow certain guidelines and that can be also implemented in more sensitive industries like finance or medical care and these kind of topics or even like where you have to authenticate users those kind of things so this platform is super amazing I definitely recommend checking it out I will also bring a lot of more content about Rasa on my channel because you guys really requested it thanks th uh, since my last video and I'm, I'm excited myself because this this whole thing is it's so versatile and we have seen it now in two three projects where it becomes like a completely different tool so you use the same service but it, it goes into completely different directions and it still works just perfectly and I, I really appreciate that especially coming from a developer background right you know things like automated deployments etc and with Rasa it's just beautiful I just definitely recommend checking it out but uh, yeah that's that's it from my side and now I think I shared my love about Rasa more than I probably should have so let's just wrap the video up I think this is already very cool and those four tools I definitely recommend checking them out in case you do something with chatbots yourself or you want to implement them into your business it is worth looking into them and for now thank you very much for watching I appreciate you taking the time to stay here watching my videos watching it until the end especially so in case there's anything I can do for you guys you're definitely the life source of this channel drop me a line down below in the comments very very happy to look into it and I'm trying to answer as many comments as I can so for now that's it and see you next time